Wait, what? Oh, here, here it is, here it is. Okay, I used it again. Okay, I think I might be like maybe top five, but definitely not like ridiculously high. No way, I got first. Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to Hypixel Solo Skyblock. So, really quick before we get into this video, I just want to address something. In my last video, I got quite a few angry comments, and like, low-key, they were kind of justified because I hadn't properly explained what was going on with my channel, and a lot of people were really confused. So, as you guys probably know, I've been uploading a series where I start completely from scratch in Hypixel Skyblock, and I had like a really specific plan to get to the late game properly, but Dungeons is actually coming out way sooner than I thought, and about two weeks ago, like everything changed when Simon said that it'll be in a matter of weeks. I had like a really tough decision to make, which I didn't really talk about on this channel, where basically I had to decide if I wanted to continue the solo series and like not be able to upload Dungeons videos when the update drops. I decided that it's definitely better content wise for me to like upload Dungeons. So I definitely should have been more prepared to take that risk when I started the series. But over the next like two weeks, Basically, I'm turning this profile into like a late game one and essentially like my videos are going to be more focused around things like a bizarre flipping guide and then like a guide for new players. As long as people understand the situation that I'm in, like if you guys don't like my videos anymore, that's completely chilled. Like I get it, you know, that series was entertaining and helped out new players. And you guys are probably thinking like, why wouldn't I just continue my other profile and then like continue the solo series and then just switch over at the very end. But because of like personal reasons, I can't really continue that profile. And also it wasn't even that progressed like skill wise. So I thought it'd be better for me to do stuff on this profile. And the final thing I'll say is in a few months time when there's like a break between content for dungeons, um, I do plan on like doing another solo series and just like starting off at the same point. As long as people understand the situation, then I'm chilled. Like, it is a tough situation, but yeah, I don't really have much of a choice, and I'd literally be screwing myself over for the future if I didn't, like, do what I'm doing right now. But yeah, anyway, we're gonna get into the video now. So, as you can see right here, we have a level 92 golem pet, and this thing is ridiculously OP, okay? So this pet's third ability, which is called Toss, means that you deal 476% more damage every 5 hits, and this thing is ridiculously OP. Basically, I don't think it's meant to stack with crit damage, so I'm pretty sure it's a glitch and it'll get nerfed, like, very soon. But I can literally do, like, hundreds of thousands of damage with my fist with this pet. Like, it's actually insane. So the way that you get this pet is by killing something called the Endstone Defender, which is a brand new boss that lives in the end. So, really quick before I, like, start abusing this thing, we're gonna head to the end and we're gonna fight one of them. And there's, like, a maybe 1% chance that I could get this pet for myself. It's worth like 100 million coins right now, which is just ridiculous. And really quick before we head over, I'm just gonna craft one pet, okay? We're gonna craft something called the Endermite pet, and this thing's really expensive, but it's really good for making money, and also like the epic variant is actually better than the legendary. So yeah, let's just go to the bazaar, and now we're gonna buy the materials. The legendary is surprisingly better for like new players, because it gives you bonus speed. But the thing is, if you have speed pots and like good armor, there's just no need for the third ability. So I won't even be mad if I don't get the legendary, but I kind of want it anyway. So yeah, we're just going to go ahead and order 512 of this. I'm going to place all of this around the edges. And we're going to put a super egg in the middle. And hopefully I can get a legendary. But if I get an epic, then I won't be mad. Because either way, we can showcase it. Alright, mystery endermite pet. Here we go. 3, 2, 1. Okay, we got... <laughs> Dude, why do I want to do one more? Like, I literally just want to craft... Okay, I got so many comments of people being like, Dude, Speed Sylvia, you're addicted to crafting pets when I crafted like a ton of chicken ones in a row. And the thing is, it was fine when I crafted the chickens because they're like super cheap. But this thing is so expensive. So... Oh wait, I just realized... I have this, right? Petlock 4. Okay. I gotta craft one more with that. Like, this thing gives you a plus 20% chance to find pets and craft higher tier pets. Why did I not drink that earlier? That's so bad. Okay, let's drink up the Petlock 4 potion. There we go. Okay, Hypixel, please give me a legendary. That's all I want. 3, 2, 1. No! No! Okay, one more, one more. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm not actually gonna do one more. Also, I've been making some progress on stream with Slayers, and this is just gonna be, like, kind of satisfying to watch. So we have a Scorpion foil right here, and I'm gonna go ahead and claim this, and we're gonna combine these hot potato books with this sword. And if you guys wanna see me do Slayers, then head over to my Twitch. I usually stream, like, right after I upload, so there's a good chance I'm streaming right now, so... And I can try the Golem pet against the Spider Boss once I've maxed out this sword. Okay, so let me just test out this pet. So I think if I just, like, kill an Enderman, it should make, like, a crunch sound and then give me coins. Let's see. Okay, yeah, did you hear that? It's so satisfying. Okay, yeah, this thing is so nice. And it means that you have like a ton more inventory space while also earning more coins because I think once you get it past like level 50, 
it starts selling for more than you could sell the actual ender pearls for. Yeah, this thing's just really satisfying for grinding zealots. And if you head down to the like actual, you know, nest place, when you kill zealots, it basically just makes everything like way more satisfying. But yeah, if I just run over here, you guys can see that there's like a golem head poking out of the ground. And as you kill zealots, it slowly rises. And I think in like 2000 zealots time, this thing is going to grow. So I'm going to stick it out in this lobby, okay? We're going to try and like kill some zealots and, you know, maybe get a summoning eye. And over time, you guys will see this thing rise out of the ground. Actually, I should use the golem pet against the endstone protector boss. That's probably like a better idea. So what we're going to do right now is I'll come back to the end a bit later and we'll fight the boss. And then that'll give me like a higher chance of getting my own pet. Like, I, I doubt it'll happen, but yeah. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to take out a Reaper Falchion. And we'll just see how much I do per hit with this thing. So... 93,000. All right, so it's not insane, but it's like a pretty a pretty good amount of damage, I'd say. So now I'm going to equip the level 92 golem, and I think this thing has some basic stat boosts, which are plus 46 strength, so it might go up to 100k. Yeah, 105k. All right, that's a huge increase. Okay, so when I hit one more crypt ghoul, it's going to deal insane amounts of damage. Okay, here we go. We're going to use the toss ability. Wait, I didn't even get to see, <laughs> I didn't even get to see how much that was. 524,000 damage. That is ridiculous, dude. I'm gonna be able to like place so high against the uh, golem boss. All right, here we go. We're gonna spawn a tier four revenant, and if I place down a mana flux, I should be able to kill this thing so quickly. Wait, what's it on? It's already on 600k after like two hits. It's gonna die in like one more hit. Yep, there we go. All right, yeah, this thing is actually insane. Like, I'm almost 100% sure this pet's gonna get nerfed eventually. So if you guys have one yourself then just abuse it, okay? Because this thing is just ridiculous. Okay, so if I kill one more spider, then the boss should spawn down. So we're going to go into this nice, like, room here, and then we're going to tap this spider. Okay, here we go. 915,000 damage. Okay, that's my record right there. That is insane, dude. All right, well, we're going to head back to the end, and we're going to use this thing against the uh, endstone protector boss, and then I'll probably be able to place, like, quite high in damage. Okay, I finally found a good lobby. So as you can see right here, it has the hands and uh, I mean, it looks kind of like a golem. <laughs> Not really, but yeah, it's going to spawn in like maybe five minutes or so. And I have 10 minutes worth of pots left. So I think we're good to go. A dragon is happening. Why is a dragon? Okay, I don't even have a bow, right? I literally have this spicy silk edge sword as my main weapon. All right, well, I mean, I have tarantula, so I can probably melee the dragon. I mean, that could be fun. Protect a dragon. Interesting. Okay, I'm hitting it. I'm hitting it. We're doing it. Yes! I'm actually insane. <laughs> I literally didn't even have a bow. Okay, we got three protective fragments. I mean, that's not bad. Oh, I should have called out my golem pet, dude. I am so... I am actually... I'm mad. If I actually get to use this pet against a dragon and they do one more, then that's going to be insane, dude. Okay, so I'm going to be able to use my toss ability on the next thing that I hit. So hopefully the boss is going to spawn soon. Wait, it just turned into obsidian. What does that mean? Dude, it has to spawn soon. There's no way. Oh, what's this? Wait, what? Oh, here, here it is. Here it is. Okay. I think I used my ability. But I, oh, it's just going for me. It's literally just going for me. And it's lagging. No. Dude, okay. Well, this is the boss fight right here. But I think I can just keep using my ability and dealing insane damage. But I don't know if I'm actually going to place because of this lag. I don't know if it's just me or if, like, everybody's experiencing it, but... I don't even know, dude. Okay. I feel like I'm gonna die, dude. It's doing so much damage. Alright. It hit me again. I think I'm still using toss against it, so... It's good, right? I think I think I might... Holy, dude. I used it again. Okay, I think I might be, like, maybe top 5. But definitely not, like, ridiculously high. No way I got first. No way, dude. I've literally never got that before. Wait, what, what did I get? 10 enchanted headstone. Any pet? Any pet? Question mark? A poppy! Let's go, dude! <laughs> Alright, well, I mean, yeah, if that doesn't prove that this pet is ridiculous, then I don't know what does, because I am literally combat level 21, and I don't even have, like, many talismans at all. So yeah, that is just insane, dude. I did not expect to get first. I got first by, like, nothing, too. Holy. 10 enchanted headstone and a poppy. Okay, I might put the poppy on the auction house. I don't know if they're like rare or not, but I'm gonna put it up for an hour. And then let me just sell the endstone. 37,000 coins. All right, that's crazy, dude. That's actually crazy. All right, so I just found Squirty Squid's rock. All right, and I just had an idea. If this video somehow gets... Actually, you know what? Let me ask him. Squirty Squid, 
how many likes do I need on this video? Let's see if he talks in chat. Whatever he says, you guys have to do, okay? He's looking at me, he's like, hmm? <laughs> yeah? Pick a number of likes. 69k? <laughs> okay, right, let's say 6.9k because that is not happening. I don't even get 69k views. Yeah, okay, guys. If this video gets 6.9k likes, I will go all the way into the deep caverns and I will go mining until I get a rock pet, okay? The most OP pet in the game. And uh, yeah, it's, I mean, I don't even know how I'm gonna like make a video out of that, but it will be kind of funny. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy the video, then uh, leave a like down below. And if you're not already subscribed, like 80% of people who watch my videos, then hit subscribe right now and I won't fire this arrow at you. <laughs> Why are there so many people crowding around me? Okay, anyway, yeah, that's about it. See you guys later. Peace.